Ahem. Hello everyone, uh, my name is Octo, I am the uh, main tank slash uh, main support for the bot burgers. Uh, hi, I am the certified African American slash mental health coach for bot burgers. Oh, and my name is The Pigeon. I am the professional comedian, professional bench player, and scientist for the Bot Burgers OW team. And uh, today we will bring you guys some very vital information. We are watching the um, Overwatch League as it's back on, and we are watching the Florida Mayhem and Soul Dynasty game. But our boy Aunt Jemima came to came to us with a, with a with a vision he had in one of his dreams. And this very, Absolutely. this this vision, this vision, will be explained to you, and all will be known in just a matter of uh, in, a few, in a few moments. I want to start with the days of the Uwu League Zero team. Okay, we have we have three three main proprietors, and these are Puku, the Jag 07, and Lichness. All right, and here here's here's the big thing. All right, Aunt Jemima came to us. And he proposed the idea that maybe Puku and Lich were dating. This is what this whole video is revolved around. Let me let me let me expand. Okay, so Puku, Jag, and Lich are on the same team, correct? We've established this. The thing is, Puku and Jag like each other, but then Giga Chad Lich shows up, right? And and Puku just fell for him instantly at the drop of a hat. So then Puku drops Jag and, and gets with. Gets with Lich, you know? They lost their drip. Or you know what? More Jag more so lost his drip. Lich was giga drip at that point. Anyways. Anyways. So Lich and Puku start dating, right? And then Puku starts Puku and Jag break up, right? Because they lost their their their, their mega drip. Lich has the mega drip and Puku wants the mega drip. So obviously she would go to Lich. Anyways. As they play, Puku starts saying her signature, mm-hmm. And and Lich just falls for her as well in an instant. He he, the mm -hmm, rocks his socks off, right? And Lich and Puku's relationship get a, actually gets a bit rocky uh, due to other people knowing and just constantly talking about it. Oh, Puku and Lich, Lich and Puku, yada yada yada. They just couldn't handle it, so they vouched to never never speak of their relationship ever again. But they they were still they kept their, their their relationship a secret. Now I want to hand this over to my. Uh, my compatriot, uh, Aunt Jemima, please take it away. <clears throat> Hi, I am Aunt Jemima. I am also the certified black man. The certified African American. I apologize. <clears throat> During this time, Lich and Puku talked a fair amount. And Lich talked about interested in forming his own team. And that's where we come in. Bot Burgers OW. Lich and Puku talked about forming a team, and they vouched uh, to keep their shit a secret. <sighs> Lich and Puku promised to protect Jag for the sake of Jack's personality. His personality makes him seem like he likes Puku, and to further hide their relation. They plan to draft specific players due to their personalities to make, their, to make it able to hide a relationship. Like, uh, here, Pigeon. We got Pigeon. Look at him. He's he's always playing. Like he's always having fun and laughing and being loud. That covers their relationship. It puts a tarp over it. Hear me out, guys. Me. What am I do? I'm always screaming and crying myself to sleep. Ha <laughs> ha. Get it? Funny meme. <sighs> so what Puku did? Puku hired her younger self, Sunshine, A.K.A. Doria the Fish. To play in our pugs and not get picked up, but to get close to a specific main tank by the name of Kai. My turn. I'd, I'd like to hand this over to the pit. Oh shit! Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, okay. So this is essentially what happened, right? After this whole, after Puku went time traveling, all that shit, back to get Sunshine, essentially the younger version of Puku, the entire pieces were placed the entire roster was drafted but there's some questions about the roster there's some questions i don't even understand for example why was i picked up over z Bauer, the legendary z bauer here i have some more evidence some more information some more shit that can lead to this conclusion right okay so i believe that lich and puku really wanted this team so they can start learning how to become fucking parents dude okay okay 
essentially coaching and managing these people it's essentially like this is just my input on it this is essentially them trying to learn for parenthood they're taking this shit all the way to the eighth mile they're going the full all 100 yards for this so essentially back when back to what i was gonna say and what jemima was saying some people were picked up due to their personality their loud voices personality people like me people like on jemima we're constantly memeing we're constantly loud whether we're in the team Jemima's, of course, more loud in the team, and I'm more loud outside of the team. This really just hides the, what the real intentions of the Bot Burgers team is, according to Lich and Puku, and maybe potentially even Jag. We don't know if Jag is a pawn in all of this, but this is just information we have gotten, we have sort of just created. Um, Specific people like Kai, Kai is a great main tank, and his personality is really out there. And essentially, with people like Kai, they hired people like Doria to sort of keep him in check. He's going to do good, but this is also going to protect this, and it's also going to protect that. The reason why Kai was added to the team is because of his skill. But they also added Doria because Kai is the Giga Chad of the team. And what do Giga Chads do? They are their own lone wolves. And what do these lone wolves do? They will find out information. Kai was kicked out of the team because... And I say because he figured it out. Because after Doria broke up, because the full plan didn't go through Doria or Young Puku, Kai went and figured it all out. And by the time he was going to Vietnam, it wasn't planned but for a summer vacation. It was planned by the manager, Lichness. I'm going to conclude it there. We have found out the information. We are scared for our lives right now. Um, Octo, you have any closing words? Wait, Jemima? I, I think someone actually might be calling us right now. Wait. Um, so, wait, oh no. you figured it oh, out. Oh, oh, God. Is that? Oh, no. Oh, no. That's oh,